Sponsored by aim to game Servers. You're the best. I recorded um, that. <laughs> no, you didn't. <laughs> I, are, you, are, are, you, are you ready for this? Yeah, I'm ready. All right. What episode? What's, uh, We're on eight. Epi- is this episode number eight, Teddy? Yes. All righty. Let's I, it. I believe it's eight. So. And we're going. Hey everyone, welcome back to FTB Horizons Daybreaker episode number eight with Teddy. <laughs> Teddy, that's a nice looking sword you yeah, got there. Yeah, it is. Come out here, I'll show you. Friend. Show you. Come here. That's a fancy looking door. I got you stuck got in the there door. Too. Yeah, I got stuck I in the door. That. Look how pretty that door is, Teddy. Yeah, it's amazing. How good your it's armor? Like um, my armor is actually probably the best ever. See? Half a heart of damage. <laughs> Your sword is pitiful, dude. I'm not even kidding. Why do I have yellow swirlies, dude? I don't know. You you inflicted yellow curse onto me. Yeah. Um, <laughs> that's like the worst sword. <laughs> what was that? Ah! Ah! Dude, what the... What? Yeah. What was that for? I am so off. Damage to me. Oh, apparently. Ah! ah stop doing it again! <laughs> I got it. I I'm getting hit by lightning. I'm going to jump in the water. <laughs> oh, that. Okay, you're not swirling no more. <laughs> oh, is it the effect that does that to me? Yeah. I thought you were like trying to hit me with lightning or something. No. That's a yellow angel steel sword, sir. Okay. What does the blue one do? Um, I don't know. It's a fancy road you got there, Daddy. Angel steel sword. Uh, green, orange, yellow, green, blue. Uh, it will apply curse the seek that seeks out cracks in the enemy's defenses. It will rapidly damage them below if. Drap- rapidly damage the enemy below if they drop below half health. Ouch. That's pretty crazy, dude. Let me go you make one. Fancy- I'll hit you with it. You got a fancy road over here, man. Yeah, it doesn't do much, see? <laughs> doesn't doesn't do a lot unless you run on it. <laughs> Running on it, run- run- ah! Oh, I teleported. <laughs> <Rawr>. <laughs> I love that, dude. We've been a little busy since the last episode. Rawr. Jade helped us out. He helped us do a lot of awesome work with us and uh, set us up a whole bunch of stuff down in the basement down here. We <laughs> Couldn't even tell what was going. Even He even set us up because he knows that we're going to be working in Galactic Craft very soon. So he made us up some oxygen masks, oxygen gear, and we got our oxygen oh, yeah. tanks and everything. Yeah. Pretty awesome. We got uh, the compressor set up and crafted, the circuit fabricator, electric compressor, and I believe he even set us up a NASA workbench, I want to say. Boom! Oh, yeah, that <laughs> thing. <laughs> Those guys are awesome. It just takes a little bit of time to craft. Uh, the compressors and the machines here. Electric compressor just requires electricity and compresses metals. Uh, this compressor just uses regular fuel to compress metals. Plus, I believe the electric one's faster. Circuit fabricator cater makes the... um wafers for us and everything we need for Galactic Craft machines and such. It's all complicated. So, yeah, it's a little complicated. I think we're going to be working on this in the next couple episodes. This episode or in the next episode maybe, I think, would be a, a fun time. He even got his head here somehow. Um, Jade Hunter's head. It wasn't because of my sword. Oh, <laughs> well that makes sense now because it wasn't because of your sword at all. <laughs> Well, Daddy, what do you want to work on today? I know if we're going to be heading up to the moon... Not, are we going to do the moon or space station first? I think space station, station. would be kind of cool. Space station. Space station. Um, I know we're going to need obsidian for fuel. We do have a fair amount of obsidian. Yes. But I know we're going to need a lot of other little materials like enderpearls and... And we don't have resources. a lot of those. We got six. That's enough to get me started. Yeah. But we but need more. 
if we need more and more, I think we're going to have to start working towards something that's just going to keep giving us items. Yeah. I think it's time for a little bit of equivalent exchange. If I, I can feel type it. dirty. I feel dirty just talking about it. Really? Yeah. Why, Danny? We have a digital miner downstairs. Did you see all the ores we have? You should have felt dirty the other episode. I feel dirty for that. <laughs> <laughs> Look how dirty this machine is. Look at all the ore, man. Look at all the beautiful gold and diamonds we have. Makes me Look, we even have dense diamond ore. Look at this, man. Look sick to my stomach. I'm Look how beautiful this ready is. To, ready to throw up right now. Can you wait until we're not recording? I guess. <laughs> I'm going to break it. it. Sure, why not? It's Dance Diamond Ore. It's a fun time. What do we get? Three diamonds. Eh, better than one. <laughs> <laughs> right? <laughs> yeah. I'm like, hey, this pick has fortune on it, kind of. Breaks kind of. 32 sort of. blocks of gold diamond gets 32 diamonds. So I'm going to go ahead and do a little bit of work in equivalent exchange. What are you going to work on, Teddy? Uh, I'm going to work on our tools. Sweet. Sounds like a plan. I guess. You do like our front and back door. What do you mean you guess? I guess. <laughs> you, you 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 guess? Yeah. Guess a lot. Yeah, that's gold. Oh, yeah. That thing looks... I love that front door. It looks so nice. So good. So I'm guessing we're going to need a few of these basic items from Equivalent Exchange. I think I just crashed. You did something. I think so. You were here, then you were gone. You just don't like me. <laughs> it's not that, Teddy, I promise. <laughs> All right, Teddy, I'm back. I see that. <laughs> Welcome back. Welcome back, thank you. Um, aim to game server, thank you. Yes. Uh, let's see. Do we have any more glass laying about and around? Um... It'll be nice. Oh, there's some. That'll work. Yeah. If there once is once we need. get into this, we will not have a need for glass anymore. I know. That's what's scary. I, 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 can, I can see why you feel a little dirty about this. It's like we're not going to need for anything. Not really. Yeah, that is a little. Yeah, just a little bit. Yeah. We're gonna have Which to be, is kind of the reason why we haven't yeah, touched have into to it like, yet. Uh, we're going to have to be careful. Mm. Yeah, pretty much. Wait, oh, that's why it's not working. I need two iron. So to get started with equivalent exchange, I got a calcinator and a loodle base, research station, and a glass yeah. bell so far. A loodle base? Yeah. Oh, I'm sorry. Is it an aludel base? I have no idea. I didn't know what a, <laughs> I didn't know what a loodle base was. A it's a new it's a little noodle base. A my noodle friend. base? Awesome. Hey, I like noodles. Noodle <laughs> I like noodles. I do like noodles. noodles taste you know what good. I like more? I like potatoes. Potatoes, potato. Potato, potato. So, ah, there's I'm power lines. Okay. Assuming all we have to do now is... Hmm, I wonder if Lapis works. How much does that give me for a block? 7,776. So that's still not close to the 8192 that we need for um, minium dust. So that stings. But that does provide us a whole bunch of um, what is that? Equivalent energy that it uses? Is that what it uses? It uses something. Yeah. Something like that? Cool. Alright, let's put a diamond in here. Put some coal in here. Do I need to put anything else in there? Is in the I, bottom? I don't know. Oh wait, no, this is the wrong one. That's that's the alley. I, I need the calcinator. Which I was I was right before. <laughs> I had picked the right one before. Oh man, I remember when I used to mess with this in, in Mage Life season two. Yeah. I totally just made like a chest and a bag. Because that's all it was. <laughs> <laughs> because that's all I could have done. But now we have the ability to do a little bit more. Which is kind of cool. Kind of, sort of cool. Just a little cool. A little bit. Just a little bit. Kind of, kind of, Very sort of. Cool. Kind of, sort of, maybe. Um, do we have, like, a lot of books laying around or anything? Books? Um, I don't think so. All right, cool. Well, I just went ahead and made one anyway. I was going to say, you can just make a bunch. You know? 
Yeah, well, we'll be able to in a minute. <laughs> they shouldn't take too long once we get started in this. So, all I have to do now, I got some minium dust. If I combine that together with the book, according to NEI, this will give me a tome of alchemical knowledge. I just got to place it in the right slots. There we go. Do, 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 Teddy. Yes? Are you ready to feel so cheaty? No. That cheatiness has ever cheated you? No. I don't know if I'm ready either. <laughs> But I have a dome of alchemical knowledge. God help us all. I know it. So, um, we got a research station here, and I went ahead and placed the tome of alchemical knowledge in the left side. So now, if we ever need to research anything, um, if it's researchable, we should be able, and it has an uh, equivalent exchange value, we should be able to place it in that like research cobblestone. Table. Ooh. Oh yes. Cobblestone. Ooh, we can make cobblestone. Yes. Eddie, that is brilliant. Ooh, Why do we want to make cobblestone? I don't know. <laughs> but it'll basically destroy the item and uh, gives you the research for it. So it allows you to... La -dee -dee, -dee 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 everything. What are you doing? What are you working on, Teddy? Blaze rods. Blaze rods are cool. Um, I need chalk, I think. Probably. Is it... Ah! One, two, what? I was like, dude, you scared the floor. The... <laughs> you scared the crap out <laughs> of me. My screen started bouncing up and down. I didn't know what was going on. I was scared. <laughs> <laughs> I was flipping out. I was like, what's going on? Oh my gosh. Sorry. Anyway. <laughs> I just made some chalk. If you break the block of chalk, it gives you regular chalk. And from here, I think we just need to make the ash-infused stone. So we just need, like, um, I think we just put this cobblestone in the calcinator. I believe that'll give us some, some ash and stuff. Oh, we need to learn enderpearls, too. Oh, yeah. That'd be handy. There we That's go. why I didn't use that yeah. last one. Exactly why we have one left. Hey, we so got some ash. We have some ash. Okay, so did you put what the, exactly okay. do I have to do with this? Let's we see. need to so, ash and fuse stone. I know that. I think you got to put that in gotcha. the al, 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 so We're going to need the noodle nine bell. of those. You have to put that in a noodle bell? We have to put that in our noodle bell. Yes. Putting it in our noodle bell with, I believe, is it stone or? I believe it's stone. Yes, stone. And I think we need nine of these, actually. Oh. So, this is going to go ahead and start cooking up for us. Pretty cool. Like it? That's fancy. It's very fancy, Teddy. And Woo! I feel very, very bad about this already. <laughs> I feel so bad I'm letting you do it all. Oh, yeah, Teddy. Um, do you care to explain that? Um, maybe I was forgot to tell you uh -huh. about it. Yeah. Uh huh. Sure. Okay. And what else? What else? What? <laughs> when did that happen? Um, it happened basically the same night the silo appeared. <laughs> so cursed earth in the silo this, just this, magically appeared. One no, th this pillar. <laughs> that pillar with all the ore cascade stuff on it, right? Okay. That originally went up way high. Right. And then I built a dirt base around it, a grass block base around it, you know, with watering cans. Mm -hmm. Shh, water and cans. Yeah, so you could do the um the cursed earth ritual. Well, then there? I put fences all over it. Why? Why did you do that? Because like things won't spawn on fenced ground. <laughs> oh, that's I, smart. I, I Where did you learn that trick, Ed? Sice. What? Sice. It's his name. Um. He's a shooter. Oh, I thought you were speaking like Swedish to me or something. No, Sice. Oh. <laughs> okay. Sice. He's he's the gotcha. sheep. He's the sheep, which is like the a sheep. It's like a the human. Whoop, it's like a human sheep. I don't. He's weird. Like sheep to whoop. I shouldn't say he's weird, but sheep. Whoop, sheep the, you know, it's strange. <laughs> he's a nice right. guy. He's really smart. Oh, okay. What? There's like fresh, like made iron armor in here. I put that in there for Shade Hunter when he got tired of trying to figure oh. out how to get the modular armor working. <laughs> I guess he didn't get tired of it at I guess all. Not. 
All right. Ooh, another thing here. I want. Emeralds. Yeah. We got nine. I want to we got nine of them. We got nine of them. Sweet. All right. So I'm going to go ahead and hook this up. I think. What about setting it up like right in here? Is there enough space? Yeah. I think it's a three by three, isn't it? Yeah, I believe so. I think this would be a nice spot, just kind of like off our, our pathway here. Yeah. Right next to our beds, so we can okay. dream about this, I guess. I guess. I do like the way the Ash and Fuse Stone does look, but um, if I'm not mistaken, how do we make this bigger? Uh, have, it might be we have a to make that bigger. Meat bite. It might be a key bind. Let's see. Equivalent exchange three. Charge, extra release, G. or toggles. It G? G. Nope, G's not working for me. Maybe hold down um, and sh shift and scroll wheel, maybe? Nope. Nope. I know there's other controls in there for it. Is it yeah, there's, extra? Or... It might be charge. Might oh, be it's, yeah, it's G. It's V. It is. So if we right-click on this. Ooh. And then I think if you right-click on the center one. Go ahead. Or shift Whoa! Dude, that is so cool. <laughs> yes. Dude, this thing is awesome. I already like it. That is it. so cool. And now you got to put your book in there. You got to make another book. Okay, I'm going to make another book then real quick. Let's do that. There. All right. So I'm going to get me another diamond. We're going to have, we're going to have plenty of this. We're going to we already kind of have an idea of exactly what we want to do to fuel this thing as well. What am I doing? I need this one. What? Give me that back. There we go. So, uh we already kind of have an idea of what we want to do to fuel this and give this, you know, all of the energy value that we need, I guess, or the actual quote-unquote energy, so we can produce more stuff. And hmm, do we have more books? Paper? that work. Gee, I don't know. Do we have paper? If we don't, there's probably a billion sugar cane out there somewhere. Really? <laughs> Just a billion? Oh, not a billion. You might check that number again. Probably not a billion, <laughs> but it's quite a bit. I had to make 45 bookshelves earlier, so we're down to like 10 sugar oh, yeah. or something out there. we got to make what? sure your enchanting room is still okay. True. True, yeah. we got to set right. up that thing it's down there, fine. don't we? Okay, good. Good, good. Everything's good. Oh, nice. Everything looks nice. Perfect. So I just taught it um, Obsidian Forest, Teddy. Oh. And I got us another... Tome of Alchemical Knowledge, and we should be able to put a whole bunch of good stuff in there now. Like, uh, and by that, Blaze Rod? <gasps> like, boom! Maybe. Or uh, even, wait, hold on, why is that not working? Seriously, a block of gold has no energy exchange value? That's uh, wrong. It, it kind of gets messed up every once in a while. So. Ew. But check it out, Teddy. You can pull out as many Ender Pearls as you want. Or one. Or one. Check it out. Why, why, why does it keep disappearing? Stop getting in it! Why? <laughs> <laughs> why is it flashing? I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm backing up. I'm backing up. <laughs> there. I'll just better. shift click it. <laughs> Ooh. <laughs> Wait, Teddy. What's all this fanciness going on down here? Hmm? There's uh, fanciness going on. Yeah. Yeah. That's a matter receiver, so we can get back here. Oh, What's so we're actually going to be... Yeah. You know, this is actually sounding vaguely familiar, except for, like, com the complete opposite. You know how we're always not ready for prime time? Are we actually kind of ready? We might be ready this time. I think, I'm gonna I put think this one we over here. might be ready. Uh... So this is pretty cool looking. A dialing device and a matter receiver. Hmm. I think I'm going to put the cool. matter transmitter elsewhere. Okay. Hmm. Um, is there power here somewhere? Did you put uh, it behind? Where? Yeah, there's power back there. Okay. There's power actually underneath over on this side too. Yeah, no, I didn't, uh, didn't want to get too close to that. Gotcha. Because then you could be end good. up in an infinite loop of teleporting around to the same place. I was going to say, what do you think about us also maybe trying to hook up a way force to get back and forth between here and our silo? Oh, I can't see that or... one. Dang it. Oh, wait, you can't see that? No. The matter no. transmitter? 
Yeah, it can't. S well, maybe. No, it can't. So. Maybe I need to move this a little bit. Maybe I'll put it right there. Mm. Ooh, I know something else I can do. Or can I? Or can I? Or can I? Oh, wow, that's expensive. Eh, why not? We got a gajillion of everything now. <laughs> <laughs> We're rich, Teddy. We're rich. Holy cow, how many Interpol did you get earlier? Uh, I just shift clicked at it. Is that a is that such a wise idea? <laughs> well, I didn't want to keep grabbing. I didn't have that much room in my inventory. Oh, okay. Let's see. Let's see how much, bro. What's that supposed to mean? What? Huh? Huh? I like potatoes. Teddy. You say potato. So you... I say potato. Uh, other people say potato. Whatever. We all say something. What ah. do you say if we get started in a little bit of uh? That thing. Okay. See. Okay. Huh? <laughs> All right. Come here. I'm coming. I'm coming. I'm coming. I'm here, Teddy. What can I do? Oh, that looks pretty. Whoa, Teddy. Dude. <laughs> well, that gave you away. <laughs> here. Get on. Get. Step in there. I don't wanna. Step in there! I, I, you can't make me. You can't make me. Fine, I'll do it. <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> Dude, I like it! Except the fireworks, they can go away! It'll be alright. It'll be okay. <laughs> Everything. It'll be all. It's alright. Have a good time. Um, yeah, Dude, that is awesome, man. Yeah. So that's how that works then, huh? Yep, that's part just... one. <laughs> that's just part one. That's step one. Um, What do you say we maybe go ahead and start working towards getting ourselves ready for liftoff, then, Teddy? I'm, I'm getting something ready so we can teleport back. Roger that. That sounds good to me. I am going to get and start working on... Where's that NASA workbench thing? Should be in that chest on top of the compressor. Am I just missing it, or...? Probably. Maybe it's in the other one. Um, yeah. Yeah, it was in It was in the other one. It wasn't in the other one, was it? No. It was in my inventory. <laughs> <laughs> hey, where's that NASA workbench? You know what it's in your inventory? Teddy, where'd you put it? Huh? All right. I'm Hopefully sorry, we, this will charge in the battery thing. Let's charge in here. No. Um, yes. 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 Is there a wireless charger in this pack? Um, I would have wireless. to say no. Hmm. <laughs> No. Dang it. Sweet. Alright, so what do we need for a tier one rocket? He um Shade even set us up with a whole ton of plates and everything. But unfortunately, um I don't think he got time to set up the plates that we actually need. <laughs> like a whole ton of steel. Steel We need a whole ton of steel. Steel Steel why are we yelling steel? I don't know, but you know what I saw today? What? The Batman vs. Superman trailer. Oh, I no know. way. Yes. Sounds kind of stupid. What, what's it about? I'll slap you. <laughs> Wait a minute. Why isn't this working? What? Um. Oh, we need an ingot compressor. Do we not have an ingot compressor? Is there another way to make those? <laughs> oh my god. There's got to be an ingot compressor around here somewhere because he has compressed steel somewhere. What? Unless he just made those with a, a regular steel. There's an ox, ox. Maybe it's in his inventory. <laughs> electric ingot compressor. Sorry, track um, electric compressor. What? Steel. 
Um, compressor, electric compressor. So we need the compressed steel plates. Is what we need, right? Yeah, Ew. we do. Um, I don't think there is one of those ingot. Yeah, I don't think there is an ingot compressor. So I think we're just gonna have to make some steel and do it that way. Unfortunately. What? Oxygen compressor, oxygen compressor, electric compressor, osmium compressor. So this thing won't work? Not with what I had saw in there. We'd have to... Uh, we, we can actually do regular steel if we just, like, do steel in there like this. Cool. So we'd have to just sit here and make that a looks lot the of same. Steel. That's the same thing as this compressor. I know, it doesn't make any sense. <gasps> Ooh, hold on a second, Teddy. I have an idea. <laughs> oh, God. Does it have oh, an EMC value? <laughs> not quite. Kind of, sort of, though. Kind of, sort of. <laughs> this is going to be great. Learn that, my friend. Learn that. All right, so what are we going to exchange for this? Um, we'll just grab five blocks of gold. That sounds fine. Actually, you know what? You know what we have more of, Teddy? Lapis. Hang on a minute. I'm looking at something here. Hang on. Okay. Oh, I'm going to slap you. It's Who, a me? coal, an iron plate, and a coal. Not a coal, an ingot, and coal. Oh, is it not? No. It's fine, Teddy. Look at this. Okay. Well, I made steel. <laughs> I made a steel. What is this duo majanger you gave me anyway? Hang on a minute. Okay. Uh, Charge. This is the transmitter. You need the receiver. Come over here to the receiver. Okay. Uh, shift. Right click on it. Got it. Charge porter set to tar is set to one. Yep. Now. Dude, yes! Okay, Yes. now, we need to keep that charged up. When you go dimensions, it takes, uh -huh. like, three-quarter of it. So, it's like oh, an emergency okay. get-back device. It's an emergency get-my-butt-out-of-there, right? Yes. All right, well, um... Teddy, I'm just... I, I think we're going to work on getting the rest of these rocket parts between episodes, because it is kind of like a, a pain to craft all this crap on camera. Uh, just a whole bunch of waiting for these things to finish compressing. So I think in the meantime, maybe we should work towards setting up like a refinery real quick. How much is 1,200 gajillion joules per second? I have no idea. That sounds like a lot. What are you talking me. about? Uh, look on refi like type in refinery on uh, any I search. Okay. Yeah, it says like oh, that's there. That's has, that's the Galactic Craft stuff. It's like a gajillion jewels. It's not. A how gajillion. am I supposed to? It's not. How am I supposed to compete with that? I don't know. <laughs> you want to hit me, don't you? No. Not much. You sure? Not much. <laughs> All right, Teddy. Well, look at this. I am about to make us, and in fact, have already made us a refinery. Isn't that cool? That's cool. Where are you going to put it? Oh, right there? What right. if we need that? I don't know. We might need that. I think we actually do need that. Let's put it right here. A wrench? And then I can do this. A wrench? Huh? A wrench? You have a wrench. I don't have a wrench. This is a wrench. Um, How does this thing work? Oh, my God. Is that working? I don't think it's working. I think we need a new place for power area and stuff. I think we're getting cramped down here, Teddy. What? Really? No way. No. Uh, we, you don't ooh, have a wrench? Ooh, I do. Okay. Um, which way is which? Well, it's not going to do anything until we put... We don't... What? <laughs> Here, let's do this. What? Let's set it down. Okay. Okay, it has to come in the top. <clears throat> oh, well, that's stupid. So if I set it like... Can you rotate it? Uh, which way? Will it go... Will it flip around? Yeah, like that. I think. No. Alright. 
All right, well, you work I will on that. Fix I, this. I am going to make us a canister, my friend. Blam, blam. Booyah, fixed. Boo oh, oh, well. That was quick. <laughs> Where's that That's canister at? Friend. I don't know. I haven't done it yet, Teddy. I'm working on it. Oh, my God. Slow down, man. Where is tin, anyway? Do we even have tin? Do we own this metal? Oh, there it is. Seriously? <laughs> do we have tin? Do, do we even own this metal? We probably don't have a lot of it after he built all the machinery and stuff. Probably. So let me get some more cast strike going. Yeah, um... I'm going to go ahead and stop the production of steel at the moment. And get us a little bit of, uh the tin going. I think we need six pieces of it. Here, let me just grab some tin over here, because this stuff's good. Yeah, that's the good stuff. We do. Alright, we'll put that in there. Wow. I'm making us the good stuff, Teddy. Mmm. Then that's we just need uh, good one stuff. piece of... Oh, yeah. Oh, wow, there's tin down here in this one. I, I think that's for the tin deck right... Oh, wow. Yeah, he remembers <laughs> how much you love tin decoration blocks, by the way. You got like oh, a stack yeah, and a true. quarter of them. <laughs> oh, yeah. Plus there's comp that's compressed fun. aluminum. Dude. Oh, my gosh, dude. Those are the best. I love those things. Those tin decoration blocks. No, you do? Yeah. Weird. Well, um, yeah, if that's not a... <laughs> Teddy, <laughs> do you have your eye bench on you? Yes. Do me a favor real quick. Okay. Put that in the top, left, right, and bottom center slot. Okay. Put that in the center. Pull it out and tell me what you notice. Well, that's a dupe bug. <laughs> <laughs> I see why he wants to get this fixed soon. It's a wee bit of a bug. I would have to say so. Um, that's an easy way for us to get uh, plenty of stuff. Yeah, except now we got a bunch of canisters that we can't do anything with. <laughs> hey, look at all these empty canisters um, we got. I don't know, Teddy. I don't know what to do with them. Um, but I will say this. We are making fuel. Is there any interesting tanks we should put this in? Um, Any ideas? Not sure. Let me look. Oh, yeah, mechanism. Uh, dynamic tanks. Oh, dynamic tanks? Uh, yeah. I see portable tanks. We could make something like that. We, You know what we could do? Now that we have ender pearls, we could ender tank it over to one of those tanks. Right? Hmm? Huh? Do what? I was just... Um, I was looking at was stuff. I'm sorry. <laughs> Don't hit me. Oh, Steel in a bucket. Steel in a bucket makes four dynamic tanks. Hmm. And I got to remember how to put those together. I think we might have to work on that next time, Teddy. Mm. Sadness. I think so. But I have to say, Teddy, we got a lot of cool stuff done today. Check all of this out. We got the matter receiver that you set up for us with these awesome charger portals, which means anytime we just need to come down into the basement, we just, wherever we're at, bloop, oh, hey, Teddy, what's going on? Meet me back at base and stuff, and that's awesome. We need to set up one of these over to our silo, even. That wouldn't be a bad idea. You having fun there, Teddy? Oh, sorry. <laughs> and then we also got set up... Um, a little bit of equivalent exchange to help us along with everything as yep. well. What are we going to fuel and that with? Actually, fuel what with? The, the the tablet? Yeah. Um, I was thinking you got to set up with the tier 5 soul shard here. This uh, blaze shard uh -huh. right here from soul shards. Yeah. Uh, if you look at a blaze rod and how much it's actually worth... It's worth fifteen over 1,500 energy, or EE exchange, or equivalent energy, whatever. 
And, uh, yeah. Setting up a blaze farm with that and just providing this thing with a whole bunch of blaze rods, I'd have to say that'd be a good way for us to uh, supply ourselves with uh, a whole bunch of everything. Oh. Tilly, tell me how much you like this chest. I hate it. It's terrible. <laughs> well, then... I want to say thank you guys so much for watching. Found a place oh, to put all our empty tanisters. Oh, nice. Done. <laughs> we figured out the game. We just figured out the game. <laughs> so, anyways, guys, thank you so much for watching. Hopefully you guys enjoyed. Let us know what you guys think. If you guys have any helpful tips, tricks, or comments, feel free to put them in the comment section down below. If you guys would rate the video, me and Teddy would greatly appreciate it. And until next time, we'll see you guys then. Goodbye. Goodbye.